Hey, this is a video on um, the makeup that I use for my skin. Um, my skin is dry, very dry, and these products that I'm going to show you um, have been like the amount of times I've gone to um, different makeup counters and asked what's good for dry skin, what's good for people that have had um, acne. At the moment, my skin is quite clear at the moment um, because I've been on medication for my skin. Um, and at the end, of, this is my makeup at the end of the day, so it's kind of wearing off a little bit at the moment. But I thought I'd show you guys how the, the makeup that I use and how I um, how I put this on and everything. So we'll start with we'll start with this. This is my Nivea Day Cream Moisturizer. I've tried loads and loads of moisturizers for my skin. Benefits moisturizers, Max moisturizers, but this has been the best one so far. And this was um, from Body Care, and this was. Two ninety nine um, for this, and I've had this three months now, and it's lasted really, really well, and it's perfect for before I put on my foundation. Um, so that's my moisturizer. Sometimes I like to use this before I put on my foundation. This is um, Professional by Benefit, and I tend to put this around my eyes, around my nose, and on my cheeks because it tends to be on my cheeks where I get blemishes. Um, it's you can either put this on with a little brush or with your fingers. I, I tend to put mine on with my fingers because it goes on a, a bit better um, and it just makes your skin really smooth and it's perfect for putting your foundation on because your foundation just sits perfectly on top of this. Okay that's so that's that. So onto my foundation and my foundation is the 25 hour lasting finish from Rimmel. I've been using this for about a year now and this is um, this is shade is ivory, and this has been a really really good foundation for me. It does last as long as it says on on the bottle, and it's been really good for covering up the tiny little blemishes that I still do get now. Um, I've had loads of other foundations by Benefit, by Mac, by Dior, all these different. Um, all these different foundations but this has been the best one without a doubt and this is eight pounds a bottle but it does last quite a few months I've had this one five months and I'm still not even halfway at the moment and I put it on with this brush and this was from Superdrug and this was about six pounds not not very expensive and I use three squirts of this on my back of my hand mix it with the brush and put it on my face and this is much better than using your hands to put this on so that's my foundation while my foundation is drying I sometimes like to use this um, brow kit by Benefit um, this is um, specifically for people with dark eyebrows and um, this just sort of fills in your eyebrows and makes them a bit more defined um, on your face. I don't use this every day but this is nice sometimes especially on a night out this is a nice thing to use. Um, so yeah that's uh, the brow kit by Benefit. This is my blusher that I use. Uh, this is uh, Rosy Glow in the Natural Collection by Boots. This was £2, it's not very expensive at all um, and I put this on with a little brush just on my cheeks, just on my cheeks here um, and this has been really good. This lasts a long time as well. You don't need to spend a massive amount on a blusher when this does the job just as well. Um, and now for my mascara. I've recently bought this new mascara by Benefit called They're Real. This one just here. And this is amazing. I've got this on at the moment, as you can see. Um, it really, really makes your eyelashes stand out more than normal. Um, mascaras do and um, it lasts a long time so I've had this about three months and it's lasted really really well it's definitely worth the amount of money that you pay and um, it's it's been really it's been really good for for my eyes anyway at least and then on to my lipstick this is uh, this is um, by Too True this is a makeup range 
from Superdrug and um, this is number th lipstick 3, they don't have names, it's just numbers, so this is lipstick 3. Um, get this colour, it's kind of running out now, but I've got that on as well. And um, this is this is really good, it's lasted quite a while as well, and um, it's just nice for your lips and everything, and it's a nice neutral sort of colour to wear day or night. Now on to um, two products that I have that I don't use every day but I think are really good. One is this ben Benetint by Benefit. You can use this for your lips or for your cheeks. I use it for my, my lips um, because it is quite it is quite red, um, the colour of it. That's that. And I've had this for two years and it's still like it's hardly gone from the top of it. It's a really, really good product. I highly recommend this for your lips. It's just a little brush. You just put it on over your lips and it lasts a long time on your lips for the day. Um, so that's that. And the final product, this has just come out by Benefit. I've had this about a month. Is this World Famous Neutrals Eyeshadow Palette. Um, this is specifically for brunettes and people with dark eyes. These are the colours that you get in the back of it and um, I like you can combine these with a daytime look or a nighttime look. So if I just show you. So yeah you have your two base colours, these two. Uh, this one's called Birthday Suit and this one is called My Two Cents. You can use those on their own or you can put them as a base and then combine them with these four colours. For the night time I generally like to use birthday suit and then combine it with this one at the top, Kiss Me I'm Tipsy. And for the day I like to use My Two Cents and combine it with Guilty, Guilty Pleasure there and these are amazing and so, so good and it even comes with a little manual and a mirror to show you the best way to put them on. And that's just come out by Benefit. I'd highly recommend them. And they do them in this colour and there's two other sets. But this was the one that I got because it's for brunettes specifically. Um, so yeah, that's, um, that's this makeup tutorial. I will be doing more videos on how to actually apply different this makeup that I've got here to show you guys how to do it. Um, but thank you very much for watching. If you have any questions, comment below and I'll see you on my next video. Bye.